The Chief Justice of the Karnataka High Court, Justice Dinakaran, who's been accused of corruption, is being transferred to the Sikkim High Court. This after he defied the Supreme Court Collegium's advice to go and leave. This is the official residence of Karnataka Chief Justice P.D. Dinakaran. The Chief Justice has, of course, been facing allegations of land grab and corruption. His house has been locked to outsiders and to the media for a while now. The Chief Justice has been working from home for several months now, conducting administrative affairs from here. He has not been going to court or conducting any judicial hearings. Justice P.D. Dinakaran being transferred as the Chief Justice of Sikkim High Court a week after he defied the Supreme Court Collegium's advice to go on leave. A decision welcomed by lawyers in Karnataka. After considering the entire thing, the Collegium has taken a right decision in the interest of the judiciary and uh, it amounts to uh, upholding the interest of the judiciary. Matter. But is Justice Dinakaran in for more trouble once he takes charge in Sikkim? Despite of our protest to the authorities concerned, he is transferred here. We will be in no position to appear before him and we will therefore have to decide and we have decided to refrain from appearing before him. But the controversial judge does have some supporters in the Karnataka High Court. No, uh, there is no jurisdiction. The other people, they are the direct to him. Go and leave, go and transfer, go and others. Legal experts say the current issue has tarnished the image of the judiciary and the law must be changed to punish errant judges. We must have some provisions to really discipline errant judges and also must have some power to give interim directions. In fact, I would be happy if the Judges' Inquiry Act is amended. But it could be a while before Justice Dinakaran gets his transfer order. The recommendation of the Supreme Court Collegium goes to the government that will be sent to the President's approval. With Maya Sharma in Bangalore and Arunachalam Vaidyanathan in New Delhi, Nitin Gokhale for NDTV. Tuba .com.